Hey you guys, what's up? So, to, okay, I'm gonna move some bags under me. But today I have some Chipotle. I have chips, dragon sauce, um, what's it called? Oh, guacamole. And I have the new Taco Bell fries and cheese sauce and some vinaigrettes. I am so excited, you don't even know. I'm gonna open a side of cheese sauce and I'm gonna try this in the cheese sauce. How have you guys been? Sorry, I'm going so fast paced, I'm really hungry. I just got out of class. Ah, it's my first official week of class. Mm. I haven't had Chipotle in so long. But you guys, yeah, I'm in class. I'm doing labs two days a week. I haven't seen you guys in a while and I miss you guys, so. I don't think this will go brighter, maybe. I don't know if it's too dark. Mmm. Wow. But is anyone else starting school right now? It's so stressful, but it's really fun since it's like my program. It's if you guys don't know, it's a physical therapy assisting program. So it's like a medical program. Like we're in the same facility as the there's like a huge building and there's the nursing program, dental hygiene and physical therapy. So I get these vinaigrettes for this, by the way. But yeah, it's really cool. So today we palpated and palpation is kind of like feeling through the skin of bones. It's, it didn't seem that hard to me when they were talking about it. I'm like, oh, like it can't be that hard, right? It's hard. Like trying to find bones back here. And bones on some people are like harder to find than on others, so. So I'll tell you guys how my week's been. So first me and my grandma ran into a little incident. It's a long story, but pretty much we were going to breakfast just minding our own business. And we were having a conversation and there's a lady behind us, okay? I'm gonna take my jacket off. Okay. Um. Oh, hot. Oh, and I have an Izzy. I didn't even mention that. I love Izzy's. Blackberry Izzy's are so good. Blackberry is the best flavor, in my opinion. Um, you guys can get them at. I think most pandas and Chipotle's have them and then like some grocery stores. Okay, I'm so excited to try these fries. Oh, so good, okay. Mm. I had to go get these Taco Bell fries when I saw they were back. They're so good, you guys. Like you wouldn't think Taco Bell would have really good fries. These are so good and I, Love loaded fries. You guys probably know that by now. Mm. 
tell you guys I was gonna do this at home I was actually planning on it the whole time but I got so hungry by the end of class because I was there for like almost four hours and I was like I just need to do it in my car like I want it hot fresh like right now mmm mmm this is so good wow Here's cheese sauce. I'll dip it in some more. I was gonna get a side of Chipotle queso too. But I decided to go to Taco Bell also and I was like, oh, I'll just use Taco Bell's cheese. Like, I love Taco Bell's cheese. But anyway, how my week started. Mm. Sorry, you guys. I have some napkins. Okay, anyway. So, yeah. So, me and my grandma, we were just minding our own business <clears throat> at lunch. Literally, like, minding our own business. And think about this. So, this lady comes. And the whole restaurant's open. Me and my grandma are in the corner of the restaurant. She picks to sit right behind us and I was like like right off the get-go I was like okay that's like kind of weird you know like why wouldn't you pick a different place to sit when the whole restaurant's open like why right next to someone especially during like COVID and stuff like I want I don't like I want a social distance I do not want people to be by me if they don't have to but I was like okay whatever like so I didn't really think about it that much I'm gonna pour some vinaigrette. If you guys don't pour vinaigrette on your Chipotle, what are you doing? Also, I wanted to try the cauliflower rice, but it was an extra $2. <laughs> mm. Mm. So good. This is water. So she sits behind us and she's honestly like not a problem at first. Like, like she's not bothering me. I'm gonna open the chips. We get our food, we're eating, it's fine. I'm not gonna have a whole bunch of chips, but I love saving their chips for later. And I got some guac. So we get our food and we're just talking and we hear her kind of like yelling behind us but like I didn't know if she was talking to us and then I kind of had an idea and my grandma was like oh is she talking to us oh no she's talking on the phone and then the lady kept saying stuff and then she said like something that we were saying in our conversation so I like was kind of like oh my gosh is she talking to us so finally like my grandma's hard of hearing and my grandma's like I'm sorry are you talking to me? I'm hard of hearing. And the lady's all, yeah, I'm talking to you. Beep. 
and she had the B word. She's like, yeah, I'm talking to you. And I was like, like, why? Like, you don't talk. Like, come on. Like, this lady's obviously, like, kind of, like, out of her mind. So it's like, turned around after she said that to my grandma. I, like, turned around. And then she's like, I'd run right now if I was you, like, telling me I need to just sprint out of the restaurant. I'm like. And mind you not, she's screaming this whole time, like, screaming. She's not just talking. She's screaming, like, you to my grandma and you better run, like, you know. And she was screaming stuff at us before, but we didn't really hear what she was saying. We just heard her, like, cussing behind us. But I guess she was talking to us that whole time, too. Mm. Please go get these. They're especially good with the Chipotle burrito because it's not all the Taco Bell flavors mixed together. It's like Chipotle, nice and fresh, and then mm, meaty like Taco Bell. You know what I mean? There's a bee on my car. It's wiggling its butt around. <laughs> okay, anyway. Um, so, yeah, she is totally, like, psycho. Oh, also, I got this dragon sauce. I'm gonna... I've never tried this. Steph Papa's does it and did it in her TikTok, and I was like, that looks so good. I love sour cream and hot sauce. So, here we go. We're gonna give it a whirl. Okay, anyway. Yeah, so. Okay, I need to be careful. Whoa. I'm gonna just pour some like that. That is a lot more runny than I expected. I expected. I expected this to be thick. Isn't sour cream pretty thick? I guess the hot sauce evens it out, but that's weird. Okay, anyways. Mm. Yeah, so she tells me, like, you better run. And then I see, like, the waitress, like, walking up. And I was literally just, like, sitting there. Because I'm not facing her, but my grandma is. And I knew I could have ran out of there, you know. But, like, I have my grandma with me. Like, and what if, like, like she's crazy. So what so i get out of there my grandma like can't run so like what she like jumps my grandma i don't know i was just like so i like pointed at her and the waitress went up and she's like i'm sorry ma'am like what's the problem this is dragon sauce by the way it's really good actually Mmm. I really like that. Nice choice, Steph. Mmm. <laughs> Well, I'm so hungry. I literally might eat that whole burrito. Finish all the fries and all the burrito. Anyways. So. What part was I at? Yeah, I was just thinking like, oh crap. And the lady came up. And she's like, "What? what's the problem, man? I'm, ma blah, not man. She said, what's the problem, ma'am? And the lady was like, those people are bad people. Just me and my grandma having a normal lunch, literally minding our own businesses. And she was like, oh, okay. And then the lady came up to us, the worker, and she's like, do you want to move seats? I'm like...
I'm like, well, yeah, I want to move seats, but like, I thought that was the wrong thing to do. I think she was freaking out, like, in front of the whole restaurant, like, like, to nice customers, like, I feel like they should have, like, removed her from the restaurant. Or even, like, called the police. Like, she was threatening us. And then I got up, and then I was like, oh, sure. Because, like, I was just kind of in shock, too. So, it was just my first reaction. Like, okay, yeah, like, let's leave. And, um... And I got up, and then she was like, I know... And she was talking to me, the crazy lady behind me. And she's like, I know you stole my straightener, you B-word. And I was like, what the heck, dude? This lady is crazy mm. wow these are the best fries ever i'm gonna get them i wish they would keep these sorry this is all cheesy so you can't see like the good bites i don't even know if i did an up close of these mmm Wow, I don't want this to be my last bite. Like, I seriously. Mm. Look at that. Those were amazing. Please go get them right now for my sake. Anyway, though, she said that to me, and I was like, and then we moved seats, and we both lost our appetite. Like, we both weren't eating. There's a cop like parked in his truck over there facing me. I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm just eating in this empty parking lot. Okay. Anyways, I need to pour some of this. Whoop. Okay. Look at that. Sorry, I don't know what that cop's doing, so I'm just kind of, like, creeping on him. Do you see that? It's dripping. I hope it doesn't drip. So, we lost our appetite. But we were just scared of, like, walking out because it's, like... So, we were in the front room, and then, like, the lady moved us to the back room. But, like, to leave, we had to go to the front room, so... Okay, my burrito's really hot today. I put a lot of hot sauce on it, I guess. But, what was I saying? Yeah, so we were scared to leave the front way because we were like, this lady is like after us. Like, she hated us. Like, she thought we were bad people in her eyes and she thought we did all this stuff. So if she saw us again, I feel like she would have been like, especially walking out of the restaurant, like she would have done something. So I was like looking for like a strong looking man to walk us out. And they were literally all old people in the restaurant. And then there was one man, but he was in a wheelchair and he looked like strong. I'm like, oh, I'll ask that guy to um, help us out. And then I saw he had a wheelchair and I was like, I guess that won't work out. So then they escorted us through the back back door and we fast walked to my car and before we went out the back door 
we were like, where is she? And they're like, she's in the bathroom, go. But like, okay, I was just mad at the waitresses in this scenario because they could have done so much more. Like I work in a restaurant, I know my bosses would have done, they would have got that person out of there or like, or something like that. And they came up to us and they're like, sorry, you would have called the police, but she would have came back. And I was like, what? I don't know, I just didn't understand. Mm. Mm. I just dripped all over myself. Okay, well this is pretty much done. It's mostly just tortilla and like, I think this is the last piece of chicken, yeah. Okay, I'm done with that. Okay, but anyway. So yeah, they could have dealt with it so different or like maybe even offer us a free meal or what they should have done is had her get out of there, but they didn't. So that was really annoying. Um, but I'm done eating. So I'll tell you about like the rest of my week, like just how school went, like in one of my next videos, but that was just the crazy start to my week, but it ended better than that. So it's all good in the hood. I'll take one more sip of a drink with you. Cheers. Okay, you guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you sooner than later, hopefully. I am not going to wait almost two weeks again. So I will see you guys soon in one of my next videos. Thanks. Bye, guys.